Hey Vibers, it's me Inuj, and I'm back with a um, lunch for one, and I'm doing Jack in the Box again. So what I got from Jack in the Box is, I got some egg rolls, I got three egg rolls, Ooh. I got three egg rolls. Got some curly fries. What's happening back there? Um, I haven't had this in a long time. It's the pita. I don't even know what this is called. It's the chicken fajita pita. I think it's so cool. So it's like that. It's like a chicken salad in a pita bread. And then the last thing I got was some um what are these called? The cheddar bacon potato wedges. Oh, look at this. Yum. Okay, I'm gonna start with. What should I start with? Oh, and then I got a Sprite to drink. Um, should I start with the pita? Oh, I'm gonna start with. Yeah, I'll start with the pita. <clears throat> oh, yeah, I gotta say per first. So, I'm on my way home, or I was on my way home from work, and I was falling asleep, so I was like, um, I'm like halfway home. I was falling asleep, and I was like, no, I need to get something to eat, something to drink to wake me up for the rest of the drive, or it's just going to be a horrible drive. So, I had choices to do around this little spot. It's Jack in the Box, McDonald's, and Del Taco, and I chose Jack in the Box. I was gonna go, I was gonna go McDonald's, but um, but then I remembered, um, what do you call it? Jack in the Box has the potato wedges, the cheddar bacon potato wedges and I was like oh yeah I need to get me some of that mm. Mm. I'm gonna do how sauces of the buttermilk. And the sweet and sour. I think I'm gonna use the <clears throat> sweet and sour for my fries. I don't really like the sweet and sour. And I, I don't really like it, especially on their egg rolls.
grab some of the sweet and sour sauce on here. Mmm. Uh -huh. That goes better with the. Um, this sauce goes better with the french fries than it does the egg rolls. Let me try it with the. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Definitely tastes better with the fries. So there's a car right next to me. And it's kind of awkward doing this while it's just there. Because the car is on and somebody's in there. And I feel like they're probably watching me film this right now. Hello. Guess they're getting a live show. So in this, there's chicken, lettuce, tomato, and onions. So it's kind of like a chicken salad. Oh, and cheese. Instead of pita. It's good. Oh, and Happy New Year. This is my first video of 2018. So Happy New Year to everyone. Ooh, that was refreshing. Yeah. Y'all, these curly fries with the sweet and sour sauce is so good. Okay, now on to the egg rolls. One of my favorite parts. So me and my <clears throat> my friend Beth at work, 
I keep telling her that she needs to try the egg roll with the buttermilk because it's so good. And she's so scared to try it. <laughs> She's scared to try because she thinks like that the flavors won't go well together. But is there anything in buttermilk? It tastes good. Especially the egg rolls. So when I got my food, I sent her a snap of the egg rolls with the sauces on the side. I had the sweet and sour sauce and the buttermilk on the side and I captioned it, um, you already know which one I'm going to dip it into. If you've never had <clears throat> the egg rolls that Jack in the Box, like, I really recommend you getting them. They're so good. And they're, um, I forgot what I was going to say, but they're so good. I'm gonna try to try it with the button. Like, it's so good. And then last but not least, my potato wedges. I like eating these with buttermilk as well. It's so good. Oh yeah, so today is my second to last day of work. So tomorrow is my actual last day of work <clears throat> um, for this job because this was just the seasonal job. I started in October and now I'm ending right now in January. So it was a good, it was a good couple months. And um, the place I worked at was a, it's a call center, um, not outbound. So it's not me calling people, it's people calling in and they're placing orders with the company. Um, yeah, so... <coughs> 
that ends tomorrow. Um, I'm kind of excited for it to end because, no, actually I'm really excited for it to end. I'm really excited for, for it to end because one I have to wake up so early because of the work hours um, I was working 5 in the morning to 1.30 which doesn't seem like that early but number two to it is because it's kind of far from from where I live so I have to commute like an hour just to get to work which means I have to wake up earlier than um, my other co-workers because my other co-workers are like the most like 30 minutes away But this job is really cool. It's my first time doing call center. And it's really fun. Really chill. Um, and the pay is good. Um, what else? Oh. And what I also loved about it is it also helped me with my skills with my customer service skills, so I'm able to update my resume and like just add on more skills to my, I don't know, knowledge. But yeah. Our friendly left right there. It's that one right there backing up. <laughs> Thank you. Oh gosh, and then another one comes. Mm. Okay, so that is it. <laughs> For this lunch for one but before i go i want to let you know that tomorrow on my last day of work um i'm actually going to be doing a lunch for one at chick-fil-a because i know some of you have asked that i do chick-fil-a um the reason why i'm saving it for tomorrow is because the only chick-fil-a i know of is in the area where my where the job is at so since it's gonna be my last day um, commuting there um, I'm gonna do Chick-fil-a tomorrow for you guys so I'm excited for that hope you guys are too um, but until then I just want to wish you all nothing but good vibes I love you guys so much and I will see you in the next one bye Some love is meant to be.